Hello everyone, Devas is here. Welcome to another interesting tutorial in Circuit Digest. So in this tutorial, we are going to learn about a very interesting project which is based on fire detection in forest using IoT and GPRS. So here we are using uh, GPRS connectivity to connect with the ThingsFix server and whenever there will be uh, any uh, fire hazard in uh, forest, so you will get a notification in uh, ThingsFix. Okay? So, uh, because in forest areas and rural areas, the network is not very uh, available everywhere. So, uh, they prefer uh, a 2G network uh, in the rural areas mostly. So, here we are using uh, a GPRS connectivity for the IoT communication unlike the other Wi-Fi uh, com uh, the communication. So, again, here we have used a Arduino Nano a sim 800l the gsm and gprs module and a lithium ion battery because uh, in sim 800 module we can uh, minimum give 3.4 and uh, the maximum voltage we can give is 4.2 volt so again here that's why we have used a 3.7 volt lithium ion battery to power up the sim 800 module okay and we have uh, kept a buzzer to alert us whenever there is a fire hazard okay and we have used a flame sensor here uh, to actually uh, detect the fire in the forest okay so let us see the demonstration of this project so first of all uh, we have to switch on the module okay so you can see here a red light is blinking on the module so whenever the led uh, starts, the led blinking will be slow slower then that indicates that again you can see here the LED is slower, the LED blinking is slower as compared to the earlier. So that means uh, it got the network, okay. So again, then we have to power on the Arduino Nano. Here I have given the external power supply to Arduino Nano from my PC, okay. So it, now we can uh, see the status in th things peak, okay. Let us see the status of this uh, uh, forest or the fire fire status in things speak now so here you can see in the things speak uh, platform uh, so uh, it is uh, it is clear that uh, there is uh, no fire and it is normal in the indication okay and in the chat uh, you can see the log the history of the fire okay so you can see here the status so let us trigger the fire okay by creating a artificial fire here so let us put some fire so you can see if buzzer is uh, the buzzer has started alerting that there is a fire okay so let us see it in the thingspeak server as well so you can see here in the thingspeak also a lamp uh, is glowing that means there is a alert or there is a fire okay so in this way it uh, it is working the project is working so uh, here we can always always do some improvements in the project like we can uh, use a also boost converter to uh, uh, to power up the nano itself okay and we can also uh, uh, add some other sensors to uh, detect the uh, like parameters or other parameters humidity temperature of the forest also, also and we can see it in the thingspeak platform so hope uh, you have enjoyed this tutorial for uh, this uh, like this tutorial and other projects you can always visit to circuit digest and like subscribe to the circuit digest channel okay thank you so much